Tonight, police investigating the death of a man shot and killed in a parking lot in Magna. This all happening earlier this evening near 26 South and 72nd West. ABC 4's Lena Takata live at the scene with the latest tonight. Lena. Glenn, police received multiple 911 calls at about 4.30 this afternoon reporting a shooting in this parking lot here behind me. When police arrived, they found a man with multiple gunshot wounds inside of a vehicle. The man was pronounced dead at the scene. It looked like they were just kind of horsing around, like they were just kind of getting their fists up. John Dorman, a resident of the area, says he was in his apartment when he looked out the window and saw two people fighting in the parking lot. At first, he didn't think much of it. About a minute later, they both sprint back to their vehicles. Dorman says the victim entered his car in what appeared to be an attempt to flee the scene. He says the suspect pulled a gun out of the suspect's own vehicle and aimed it at the victim. I heard about 10 shots. Thorman says the suspect then went back into his car and drove away. I walked outside. There were two women uh, outside in the parking lot as well who had also witnessed it. Uh, then walked, uh, once I knew they were okay, I walked to the, uh, to the victim's vehicle, saw that he was dead in the front seat and stuff, and that's when we called 911. Uh, when our officers arrived, they located a male um, in the driver's seat of a vehicle. Um, with multiple gunshot wounds, and he was uh, declared deceased at the time. Police say the victim is a 20 year old man and was the only person in the vehicle. Police canvass the area and say they believe there are no other injuries or victims. You know, it's our partnership with the communities and working with witnesses and stuff like that that help us solve these kinds, uh, types of crimes. And so um, having that relationship and people willing to call in and, and, you know, assist us in this process is very, very important. Though the suspect is yet to be identified, police believe there is no immediate public safety risk. This case is still under investigation. Live in Magna, Lena Takata, ABC4 News.